I'm Nick Cooper, this is my wife Sue Cooper, and this is Matthew Ansel. So what's uh, what's been happening guys? You've had a pretty hectic past um, past year. What, what stage are we at with Matthew now? Um, well he's now finished his radiotherapy and he'll be beginning his uh, chemotherapy fairly soon. And then uh, after he's finished his uh, chemotherapy, that will be the end of his treatment. So what, what stage are we at in terms of him coming home? At the minute he's still at Birmingham Children's, I believe. Is that... Yeah, he's still at Birmingham Children's Hospital. Um, at the moment we're having plans drawn up to have the house modified and extended. And then uh, hopefully we'll go to the planning permission when once we've got the plans back from the architect. So today's a pretty a pretty special treat. He's come out, he's, he's come here for a couple of hours, I believe, see his old classmates. What does it mean to, for you guys to have him back here and and for Matthew himself, do you think? Uh, it means everything to us and Matthew's really looked forward to coming back, haven't you, Matthew? And he's uh, really enjoyed his time here. So it's been really, really good. And what sort of stuff has, has the little man been getting up to while he's been here then? He's been painting, haven't you, Matthew? And making some... Uh, different little artworks and I believe he, he, and other sort of talent show as well and he's been catching up with some of his old friends yep and he's really enjoyed that haven't you Matthew thank you guys Hi, I'm Julie Henry, the head teacher of Rockledown Wood Junior School. Um, today we've had Matthew Cooper, one of our children, back in school for a couple of hours, visiting from hospital. His class have done a little talent show for him and now he's doing some finger painting because nobody comes to school without doing some work. Um, we've hopefully, in about half an hour, you should hear some singing and then Matthew's visiting hospital back again. So tell me a little bit about Matthew, what kind of lad, you know, what kind of pupil is he? Matthew's the type that you really notice when he's not here. He's a, a charmer, he's a, a giggler, he's full of personality, he's got lots of hobbies and he's great to talk to about all sorts of interesting things, so we really miss him. And is it it's a special treat today for the other kids? Is it, it nice is. for those? The whole school is beyond excited, but particularly Matthew's class. Um, children have worked really hard fundraising and advertising what we need to do for Matthew, so it's a real treat for them to be able to come in and visit him in the hall and then sing for him in assembly. Because the architect is busy planning Matthew's house, ready for when he comes home. 
You're busy fundraising in a couple of weeks to put the icing on the cake for our fund. We've only got £25,000. So we're already quite, we're trying to get to 30 map before you need all your curtains done and everything. <laughs> It has taken me 50 years. Is that good? Yeah? Yeah. Is there anything else you've got to put on it? No? Is that it? She looks exactly like that. I almost put your name in her You've got googly eyes in there.